Irakli Zarakashvili versus Kitergali Ungerbayev was a phenomenal match for several reasons, but maybe the biggest reason was the absolute technical clinic put on by Ungerbayev. Some of this match was perfect textbook technique. However, there was one moment where Ungerbayev did something I don't think I've ever seen before. Let's take a look. If you have no clue what just happened, don't worry, neither does anyone else. Let's take one more look in slow motion. There are several possibilities as to what Ungerbayev could be doing here. The first idea I had is that he may be attempting to increase the depth of his grip mid-match. Here we see an example of Sarah Bachman using this technique against Chance Shaw. We first see her dragging her elbow all the way back to the back of the pad. But after this, midway through the pull, she shoots her elbow forward. This causes her hand to slip past Chance's hand. We can see that this move increases the depth of her grip mid-match. By increasing the depth of her grip, she now has more leverage to keep her wrist flexed, improving her cupping ability. However, if we compare this move to the move from Ungerbayev, it isn't quite the same angle. Ungerbayev is using a lot more supination and he doesn't really push past Arakli's hand as much as Sarah does. So it's possible that this is what Ungerbayev was doing, but it also may be something else. Another possibility is that Ungerbayev was trying to force the match into an inside lane. Maybe he concluded that the best way to defeat Arakli was not to top roll him, but actually to hook him. But I also don't think this is very likely, as Ungerbayev had already defeated Arakli in the top roll. Arakli's arm is also probably stronger than Ungerbayev's, and Ungerbayev's hook is not quite as good as his top roll, so forcing the match inside would likely be a mistake. It's also possible that Ungerbayev was doing this solely for the purpose of throwing Arakli off his game. Maybe Arakli was surprised by this unconventional pressure and it caused him to let his top roll defense down. This gives Ungerbayev a better opportunity to do a reversal and top roll once again. There's also the possibility that Ungerbayev was just totally memeing and did this to confuse everyone. I personally hope that option is correct because I find it very funny, although it may be unlikely. But let me know what you guys think Ungerbayev is doing here. Is one of the options I listed in this video correct, or do you think he is doing something entirely different? Ungerbayev is one of, if not the most technical puller in the sport today. He incorporates so many things into his game that the vast majority of pullers never do. Pretty much every match I've seen from him is a technical masterpiece. He rarely makes mistakes and he can use any technique he wants to at a very high level. But this match against Arakli is probably the coolest for me. I don't know that it's any more impressive from a technical standpoint in reality, but it got me excited about technique again as if I had never seen arm wrestling before. Watching Ungerbayev compete is a great reminder that you can always further improve your arm wrestling technique. It would be a massive accomplishment to someday reach half of the technical ability demonstrated by Kitergali Ungerbayev.